So this is uh, Shantae Half Genie Hero. There was a Kickstarter for this game, uh, I want to say a year and a half ago. Um, and I backed it, and they gave me a, an alpha code for, the, for this. I haven't seen anything saying that you can't play or uh, can't stream this. So, <laughs> I'm, well, I'm not streaming this, but I'm going to put this up. Um, and here we are. So, in case you're not aware, there's this chick called Shantae. She is a genie, and, well, she used to be a genie. And then, for whatever reason, she became human, and now she's a half-genie hero. Um, and she wears a dancer's outfit, she dances around, she crawls and, I guess, scowls angrily, which is new. I don't remember scowling while, while um, crawling before. Um, and she has a farty little soundtrack. And you turn into a monkey. Wow, and you jump a lot higher as a monkey. Oh, that's cute. You flail around. So looking at this, it doesn't look like... Well, it's certainly not 60 frames a second. Maybe it's not even 30? I just like the mermaids in the prior game. That's annoying. That she's hard to kill before you get to her. Uh... Get to um... to be in a range to kill the mermaid. I don't think you can kill her before the bubbles come. Very substantial boom when things go off screen to die. There's even uh, a um, control ship controller vibration. Oh crap! Uh, let's see. I'll jump. Yeah, there we go. Oh, treasure, treasure! How do you get to the treasure? Huh? Send in the water. Oh, lame. Can I monkey over there? I guess not. Huh. Okay, well, it's just gonna be a, a mystery. Um. Ah! Normally, I would just... Ooh, cool. Ah! There. I would just ignore you, mermaid chick. So, uh, the original Shantae game was one of the first uh, platformers that I played on the Game Boy Color. Um, and it was a lot of fun and very cute. And it, I really like the character design because it's it's bright and it's colorful. The oh shit! Oh my snakes! Um, there was generally very good level design, a lot of thought put into it. And it's also typically very hard. I don't want to say unforgiving, but sometimes it does feel, oh, shit, feel that way. And there are half-naked girls over there. Let's go investigate the half-naked girls. They do not appear to be voluntary go-go dancers. Which is unfortunate. Go-Go Dancing should be a voluntary act. Um, hmm. So one thing to note there at the bottom of the screen, you say, 
Uh, you see, this game demo is a work in progress. Actual product may vary. Um, there was a monkey loading icon before. Now there is a crab? I can turn into a crab and hide in my shell. That does not seem very useful. Man, that thud study. Those guys are designed differently. The last one, it wasn't like armored Hawkmen from uh, from Flash Gordon. It was more like um, ah, it was, it looked more like uh, demons and stuff. Huh. Jump for shit. Oh, she can swim. And she can drift and get hit by piranha. Ah, you fucking piranha one eyed mutant thing. Okay, well, that's. It's not enjoyable. Maybe it's just because of playing it's much ah much water temples I have. I just have never liked water levels. Oh, that's cool. Oh, there's stuff to explore down there. And I cannot get Can't seem to jump up that high. I know there's stuff back there to explore. I'm, I'm really not happy with water levels. No, I bet that shell protects you from damage. Oh, you can't turn into your shell while you're floating. Okay. Oh god, this is going to be annoying as all hell. Ugh. I bet the gem disappears before I can get back to it. Oh, maybe not. Almost. This sucks. Huh. Black rock. I wonder what black rock does. At least I can pull some like rats and them shit and sit here in the lead of the stone. Oh cool, you can hit these like volleyball or some shit. Oh god, this is annoying. <laughs> wow, this... This level is distinctly not fun at all. Oh my god, this level is not fun. Wind almost blew away the heart. Oh, the statue's locked into place there. Well, good. It'd be real bitch if the statues got knocked out. You had to push him back each time.
these cat abilities don't seem very um bothersome. Just something to do while the wind's blowing. Well, I'll say that that first level was fairly mediocre. This level is is unpleasant. And I'm sure there's someone out there that thinks, oh wow, those air levels where you get blown all over the fucking place look like so much fun. Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah. <coughs> I'm glad I can edit out coughs. Oh, you piece of shit. One of the things that I really detest reading on the... Oh, god damn it. The Some of the subreddits that I go to, is one in particular I'm thinking of for uh, Monster Hunter, is they have this phrase, quote, Get good. You know, whenever anyone asks for advice or help on how to counter some critter's mechanics, it's always their solution. Get good. And that seems like the most inhuman and and asshole thing. Oh, you son of a fucking piece of shit! Thing that you could possibly say to someone about, you know, how to gain skill at some particular thing. Oh good, the wind is done. Yeah, because otherwise these things would be fucking impossible. Well, that's a lot of bouncy balls. Oh, now I'm at the entrance to some kind of thing. Okay, this level I didn't like at all. The the swimming didn't feel good, but maybe that's because I don't like water levels. The wind... Oh man, the wind was annoying as all hell. Oh god, she's gonna bruise her coccyx. Oh, I can't uh, whip the barrels. Well, this is kind of cool. Certainly compared to that last level, this is... Oh, shit. Why... Why is... Oh my god, why are you throwing fish at me? Got fish being thrown at me. Got fish jumping about at me. Oh, shit. Got barrels going. Oh. Uh, jump coming up. No! Oh my god, the barrels cut up to one another. I thought I broke some of these barrels. Uh, oh, let's see if I can shoot you. Boom! Boom! Son of a fucking whore! Okay, well that didn't go very well. Oh my god. Oh god! I need a heart. Where am I gonna get a heart? I don't <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> Good, that was the end. Um, that level I liked a lot more. 
I mean, it was limited in what it did, but it was fun with what it did. Okay, so... Um, I guess these are the three levels that are present in the, uh, in the alpha. And... Uh, this first jungle one, with all the platforms and the mermaids, was a very generic level. I mean, if you've ever played a Shantae game before, you've played that level, and you played it better demonstrated. Um, I, I don't have much to say of it, because it's kind of unremarkable. This middle level, with the desert and the water, is incongruous as that may be. And the crab um, sucked. I didn't like the water mechanics. And the wind blowing you back was, was really, really annoying. I, that made me very unhappy. This thing on the rollers, I feel bad for her butt because it's got to be hella bruised. Um, but that one was a lot of fun, except for the parts where you get that thr fish thrown at you by the crocodile or alligator or whatever it is because no one likes to be hit with fish. Um, let's see, configure, controls. So yeah, I played this with the Xbox controller. Uh, it's got uh, rumble, not really force feedback, but rumble. Um, and that was pretty nice. The, the whole dancing to change forms to the crab and, and the monkey, that's that's pretty cool. I like the I like the promise of things that can be done with that. I'm interested in seeing how the, the tinker bat which is one of the, the backer benefits that you get um, if you backed it. It is going to play out in the game. It turns you into one of uh, Risky's pirates. Um, I should try the keyboard configuration controls, but I'm not going to. Um, and as you can see, this is uh, going at 25 by 14. It also appears to have some uh, 16 by 10 resolutions as well as the 19 by 10 and let's see how low it goes 640 by 480 um, frame rate feels I'll say it's 30 just to be generous but it's certainly not 60 so take that as you will uh, Shante's design hasn't really changed much like since she was created I guess she's always been in the dancer outfit um, I guess her, her bikini bottom is a different color, maybe? I don't remember, but uh, she looks basically the same. She's got a different uh, idol dance. And in that, this dancing animation is kind of silly. But that's absolutely fine. Because silly's, silly's fine. Um, and the monkey, the monkey is very cute got that little smile when she runs around little you know I'm gonna say like a, a Wonder Woman tiara but I know that's just uh, Shantae's tiara and her bracelets look really really huge unless she's been like eating lots of spinach you got the Popeye forearms going um, and the shading on those pantaloons I I wonder if that shading is drawn in, oh, I bet the shading is drawn in. It's not. It's not actual lighting. Although it's very, very smooth to have been drawn in. Let's see. Um, the uh, the uh, rolling butt stage has different lighting going on. I wonder. So there. Oh, you can't pause it quickly enough. Or at least I can't pause it quickly enough to really see. I think. I think that the shading on our pantaloons is drawn in. Um, 
Yeah, because she's been the entirely shaded there, and there's no real difference in the amount of shading. There. Might use what it is. And that dude dropped a heart, but it threw that before I could get it. That's. That's bullshit. Because if they're gonna use those as uh, heart containers, um, then, then they need to make it so that you can actually get to them. Yeah, I like that one a lot more. Anyway, uh. Based on how good the other Shantae games have been in the past, I actually think that people should be comfortable pre-ordering this. Obviously, I, I uh, kickstarted it, and, and that's just based on the promise of the game. And this was before uh, Not Risky's Revenge came out. I can't remember the name of the other game. I'll, I'll put it up on screen. Uh, this was before uh, the previous game came out, actually, on, on Wii U and PC. Um, but but that one was very good, and and I really like the Shanti series. And yeah, it's, it's a lot of fun. It's it's got bright colors. It's got a lot of a lot of really well done music and it challenging levels. It's it's not an easy game. I don't well like nothing's easy. I was gonna say it's not as hard as like a. Mega Man series, but nothing is as hard as the Mega Man So, with that being said, if people pre-order this, I don't think they'll be disappointed. Um, as far as I understand, this is coming out for certainly the Wii U. That's the version I'm getting. Likely the 3DS, definitely PC, obviously, because this is a, the Steam uh, code that I got. Um, and probably Xbox some flavor of Xbox and PlayStation. I, I don't know which ones. Because uh, that, that's not important to me to know. Anyway, um, I hope that any questions you might have had about Shantae get answered uh, just from watching this. If not, let me know uh, in the comments before uh, below. And have a lovely day.